Hey guys, today we're continuing our Among Us map. We have storage, communication, admin, and shields. Okay, maybe I was a little too harsh on the map designers of this scaled map from Among Us. <clears throat> I make up for it by creating part two of our Among Us map. We have today shields, of course, then we will create communications, we have storage and the last room we have for now is admin. Plus, I will not complain about the map designers in today's video, because they did a great job on this. This is my blueprint for today. I printed it out. It's on label paper, which means we can just stick it onto some cardboard. This is what it will look like. Boy, this is huge. Now, this is my cardboard. It's... hopefully it lasts until the last part of the skilled map is finished because it has um, a special thickness to the cardboard itself. But first things first, we work on the layout of today's map. To me, it feels a bit strange to see these empty rooms without any furniture or instruments. Thanks a lot and shout out to Andy, he did an incredible job on the editing part. But we will fill the rooms with some beautiful clay furniture later. Seems we have a black hole in our cardboard. I try to fix this so it doesn't make any problems later. While finishing the layout, I have to admit, 7 million views on part 1. Well, that was unexpected to me, no pressure <laughs> at all. Welcome to all new subscribers. When you're new to the channel, welcome to the ClickClaim universe. We try to have a really good time together, creating stuff from your beloved games with clay and cardboard. This is what I love and hope to inspire you with. We will now remove the in-between parts between the rooms and then I take care of the walls because they don't really make sense. The map designer did still a great job on this, but they just don't make any sense. So we remove the walls and replace them by our own printouts of rooms. The walls have a height of 2 cm and another centimeter below. For some of the rooms this is required. The shields room for example, because it has um, a cellar. So it is going down and I read some comments, um, people suggesting that I should create the map from underneath um, the tunnels for the imposter, which would be an amazing idea. But let me first finish the total map and then we can work on the, the underground. Now let's switch weapons. I take my hot glue gun, my beloved hot glue gun, and be careful with that. I'll burn myself probably every two or three hours. Nothing bad has happened with the scalpel yet. I'm thankful for that. I told you I fell down the stairs last week and over the past days I had no feeling in my right hand and this really concerned me because well I am sculpting with my right hand and doing this as a living um, but happily this got better right now it is um, the pinky which I don't have any feeling in 
and yeah i really hope this also gets better over the next days thank you so much for all your nice comments which i read and i realized how happy we can be when we are healthy and this is what matters and now <laughs> enough of this old man talk let's have some fun with hot glue gun okay it's empty not anymore while finishing the last parts of the walls, I have a quick announcement. A few months ago, I set up an official Clay Claim subreddit where you guys can share your, your own creations, for example, memes, and generally have fun connecting with each other and other Clay people. Um, yeah, sadly, I haven't gotten around to announcing it until now. I myself will also periodically visit the subreddit and if there's enough awesome funny things I will make a video about it and put it also in the tutorials. So after this video you guys can head over and check out the subreddit um, for all of you who are using reddit. I'm looking forward to read you right there. Now, these are the printouts of the walls. I explained that to you, that the map designer did nothing wrong here, but we found some different solutions to make the walls logical. And in the communications room, no, this is admin, in the admin room, we have a deepening in the ground on two stages, and I was lying in bed all night long, I couldn't sleep and was thinking about how to create it and this is quite easy. It's stupid easy and I am happy I came up with this solution with a hot glue gun of course. Now let's glue the beautiful background floor ground of the shields room underneath and let's get started with clay. First room we start with is admin and this looks like a pool table but it isn't. It's the table from Star Wars we all know and love and it has this hologram on top. And um, yeah, let's first focus on the table and then I have some ideas on how to create the hologram. It's the same technique in a way I also used on part one of this um, among us map. So this is the stand for the table and then we have some instruments on the left side and also on the right side with some tiny tiny buttons. I have no idea what they are for but they look so beautiful. This gray combined with green. Now I sound like the map designer. <laughs> so there is um, a grid underneath the hologram and these are the parts of some further instruments and the walls because all the the Among Us characters um, want to have some privacy while working on the screens. Yeah, I'm also working on the screen right now. We have the Wi-Fi signal uh, and also O2, and the console for O2 which I also wanted to include with clay. So I didn't want to go with a print, printed on version. I check if the walls have the perfect height and then we can put this into the oven. And oh, I forgot the security cam. Let's just quickly add this as, as well. Beautiful. Now. We are heading to storage and there is a lot to create. I start with the most important item in the room. You can already guess it. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm just honest. I was looking for a way to get in some liquid clay because it has an expiration date. <laughs> now we are sticking in a tiny piece of wood. Beautiful. Now all these boxes and while creating these boxes I was also thinking about what's inside these boxes. We have 
three barrels full of milk. It's red milk from Mars, maybe. And then we have a lot of boxes. Oh, and another tiny one. It contains milk from Pluto. And then we have these boxes, a lot of boxes, and the floating box. They are all filled with... Yeah, what are they filled with? Well, I should not answer this. You are creative as well. Write it down in the comments what you think. What is inside all these boxes? And I dare you to write something like food or milk. I already came up with milk. Now, this is the last color for these containers. It's not the exact same color, but um, I was, um, yeah tired of mixing clay colors. <laughs> no, just kidding. I was running out of time because I literally finished this project just today and I really wanted to finish it the, this same day, which means today. <laughs> oh boy. We have this beautiful tiny canister filled with milk as well. And then we have this handle it's a lever for the door to kick out the imposter or not the imposter and I totally forgot the red chairs the comfy red chairs and this is communications we will work on right now I think this is my favorite room of the four we are creating today because we have these beautiful instruments <laughs> in the background and also some headphones as well but let's start with these walls of instruments this is a recorder and it has to be part of the spaceship when astronauts tell each other jokes they want to record it so that when there is an accident People don't forget about these jokes. And then we have the plug, the plug-in for the headphones, which I also wanted to create with clay. And all the different buttons, well, some of them I am adding with clay, but after oven hardening, I will paint all the very, very tiny ones, just adding some details on the green displays. And then we have some television or screens or no these are television and also an old CRT television made it into the game which is quite funny and we have a tiny computer mouse we are mixing some brown and ochre together to get the beautiful color for the tables this is supposed to be wood I decided to not mix it too strong that you can still see some kind of a pattern inside and now we can place all these instruments and the computer mouse onto the tables which we will glue later to the walls and this is the huge desk for the boss <laughs> putting the instruments on top and also the chair right in front and we're ready to go into the oven Meanwhile, we are walking to the last room, which is shields. It is shields with a red railing and also these beautiful lights. And while crafting, I decided to illuminate this whole creation. You have seen this in the intro. I did not really intend to do this, but well, it looked so beautiful, I just had to try it out. And as I had no light bulbs, I just took some hot glue sticks. They look quite beautiful when illuminated. But let me quickly get them into shape. Oh, they look like bullets again. But look how beautiful the left one is illuminated. We need seven of these. And with silver and dark silver clay, we create the substructure for these lights. If someone of you really know what these lights are in the shields room... Oh, apparently we are washing hands. This happens so much since the latest update. 
this is the railing, the red railing. And we can put this into the oven as well. And we can start preparing the chain of lights. They are too long right now. And I just cut open the protection, not the cable itself, to make them a little shorter. And the idea is that when I drilled a hole, they would fit in. Okay. Careful with that. Would be a great way to kill someone. Oh, look at that. Amazing. This, this is funny, as the drill is getting really hot while drilling, um, the hot glue sticks melt. The substructure, which we can now glue together, and look at that. It looks so beautiful. I'm happy I decided to go for the chain of lights, and not just to create it with clay, with white clay, for example. Yeah, the big moment has arrived and we have freshly baked interior, <laughs> the interior design. And now we can glue all these different tables and instruments and chairs and milk bottles into our map. Now this is the idea I had for the holo hologram, the Star Wars hologram. What is shown right here? Is it the map itself? Oh, <gasps> it's amazing. It is the map itself. Right in the middle, the biggest room, the cafeteria with the storage underneath. Yes, this really is the map. I'm realizing this right now. I wanted to make it float a little bit, just a tiny bit. And these are the walls between the different screens. And now I am assembling this line. Beautiful. Oops, okay. This is the pipe right in the corner, the tube. It's just silver for O2. And now it looks so comfortable with these chairs. This is the Wi-Fi signal. It's on. And the security cam. And now let's work on storage. We need to bring in some details on the boxes. We have some outlines and some details also with white. Three white dots. And look at that. It looks like if we are inside the game. And then we have the big container right in the middle, also in this bright green and blue and red. And this will be the floating box because it hasn't been secured. I just take a needle for that and stick it in and we can even move it and turn it around. This is the lever, the opening mechanism for the door, which I'll totally create if I one day will finish the map and work on the... Oh no, look at that. <clears throat> yeah, what I wanted to say, when I work on the, the, uh, the outer shell of this spaceship, I'll include all the doors as well. And now we can put everything together for the communications room. We have the tables I am gluing to the to the walls and two tiny papers are lying on the table as well. This is what I really love. These tiny beautiful and lovely details in the game itself. And now we have on the left and on the right part the tables. But first, let's plug in the headphones. This is the 
left desk with the computer mouse. And on the right side. And the big one right in the middle with the chair right in front. Which means this room is also meant for one person which is rolling around on his chair. <laughs> now this is the last room. This is shields and it'll take forever or not to place these railings. And I'm looking forward to try this out, to place the chain of lights in position from underneath. Okay, be careful, I don't want to screw it up. The end card music is already playing. Okay. The last one, and is it working? Is it working? No! Look at that, guys! I guess! That's it! Part 2 of our Among Us map with communication, storage, admin and shield. I hope you enjoyed this video! Mm. This is part one and part two of our maps combined. It's so huge! Look at that! It's crazy! <laughs> Please let me know what you think, what you want to see next. Of course, probably the other parts. Guys, have a great weekend. Take care, stay safe, bye. While painting the stars in the background, I accidentally painted my trousers, my new trousers. See that? Yeah, great. Totally forgot about that.